welcome to part 10 of Tommy Johansson Week, where we are uh, going to react to one of my personal favorite rock songs uh, ever, I think. This is such an iconic song. This is Skid Row singing 18 in Life, but a Tommy Johansson cover, and I'm very excited. Now, this wasn't one of the most requested ones, but I love this song so much that I added it to the list. I'm just saying. And uh, I need, sorry about this hair, it's driving me insane. Um, I shave my head every two days, and uh, so I am I have a bald head because I shave it every two days. So having this hair is driving me nuts, I'm just saying. I've been shaving my head for like eight years now, and uh, yeah, I haven't had a luscious mane in many, many years. And so, but yeah, Skid Row, 18 in Life, I love that very first Skid Row album. I remember when they came on the scene. My brother was a major metal head, and so I learned to love heavy metal and hard rock and rock from my brother. And uh, I was more of a rap guy. My mother was a country music fan, so I've inherited all that music. I'm not a big country fan, just throwing that out there. Uh, but but heavy metal, rock, and all that stuff, all of that is because of my brother. I'm just saying. Hip-hop and rap, that's my jam, jam. Uh, but yeah, so I'm, I'm ready for 18 and life. Ricky, he was a young boy. Uh, he had Heart of Stone, and I'm just, I will not sing it, I promise, even though I'm going to want to sing it, but I cannot wait to hear Tommy's rendition of this awesome song. So uh, just before we get started, just as a heads up, I will give you my honest opinion, boys and girls, whether I like it, whether I love it, whether it's good, whether it's great, whether it's awesome, uh, even if I don't like it, I'll let you know. <clears throat> now, just as a heads up, if I don't like it, it's not a knock against you or Tommy himself. Don't take it personal, please. It's just how I'm feeling at the moment about the song. It doesn't mean it's a bad song or anything. It just means it hasn't resonated with me. That's it. It's, it's not bad. Uh, unless I just come right out and say this is a terrible song, which I'll never, I don't think I'll ever do. I don't think I've come across a terrible, terrible song. I have like 170 reaction bids, so I don't know. I don't think I have. Anyways. Also, I will give my honest opinion, but I will also react during the entire song. Uh, I don't pause it as I feel it takes me out of the reaction and it takes you out of my reaction as if I pause it and try to react. So I react during the entire song. I'm treating this as Tommy has given me my own personal concert because that's what I do. I used to pause it and then I went back and looked and I was like, this is a terrible idea to pause the song, to do a little banter and then hop back in. I don't like it. I, I, I don't like it at all. I don't like when I do it and not to say it's not the right way to do it. It's not the right way for me to do it. So we're going to rock it. So are you ready? Yeah, let's do this. Okay, we are back and we're ready to get our 18 and life now. I am beyond excited. Out of all the songs that I've seen on this list, this is the one that's really got me pumped the most, and so I'm ready. Ricky, he was a young boy. He had a heart of stone. Doom, doom, do, 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 boom, boom. Bang, bang, shoot him up. The body never reigns. Can you, can you please? <clears throat> 18 and life, you've got it. 18 and life to go. Did I turn that down? Bioware has been having For a very... For sakes. All right. Okay, let's go. Yeah, let's do this. I love it. Here we go, Tommy. Got it. 
Yes, okay. Tommy is on point. Whoa, whoa. Tommy is on point, baby. Solo, baby. They're here. Let's see it. If anybody can do it, it's Tommy. I'm ready for this epic ending. Yeah, Tommy. Okay, okay, Tommy, Tommy, that was amazing. Okay, <laughs> that was exquisite. That was, you know what's weird is this one, this was kind of like an identical uh, copy of the original. It was a cover of the original. It was, it, he, he, didn't, he didn't vary off very much whatsoever. And it was kind of like a, an, an ode to Skid Row with this song, man. I think that Skid Row is one of their best or probably most well-known. Uh, it was awesome. This was excellent. This was phenomenal. This did not let me down. This was awesome. I thoroughly enjoyed this. And he has a Green Day. Oh, Basket Case. Was that on there? I thought that was on there. Okay, yeah, this was so stinking good. Ladies and gentlemen, let me know in the comments below what you thought of this incredible song and this version of 18 in Life by Skid Row cover by Tommy Johansson. <clears throat> please comment, please comment, please comment. Also, hit that like button. Subscribe if you're having, we're having tons of fun. Maybe even hit that sub or that uh, super thanks button as well. We do have members, so feel free to become a member of this channel. We do have Ellen. We have Ruby Man. We have Live by the Medic. We have Volmec. We have PT Mart. And we have James Mucklin. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for your support of this channel. Become a member. Become a member. Become a member. Just throwing that out there. Whew, we're almost at the end. This was number 10 of Tommy Johansson Week. We got two more videos. So here we go. As usual, my name is Paul, and you guys take care. <laughs>